This time last year, the University of Texas was preparing for their final Thanksgiving showdown against A&M. After a 117-year rivalry, students said their goodbyes by putting one last hex upon the Aggies. A tradition tracing back to 1941, the Hex Rally was an event all students looked forward to. I've done the Hex Rally since my freshman year, and I'm a fourth year on cheer right now. Um, in the last three years, I think my favorite memory is lighting the candle and having everyone in the crowd and all the cheerleaders and all the football players and all of Palm, everyone gets a red candle, light it, and you help each other light it. So it's kind of a community thing, and then we all put a Hex on the Aggies. With A&M leaving the Big 12, there were concerns about what would become of the traditional Texas Thanksgiving game and Hex Rally. Earlier this year, it was announced that TCU would replace A&M. Despite the change, the university is determined to keep the Hex Rally tradition alive. We're really trying to stray away from it's just A&M. Like it's, it's, it's a UT tradition at the end of the day, and we want students to remember it's our tradition to own and not something that we give. To team. Some are skeptical of this new direction and how it affects the meaning of UT's rivalries. You kind of dilute the meaning of a rivalry when you call games between Texas and TCU a rivalry. Yeah. Well, the Hex Rally is just something so special to the rivalry that Texas and Texas A&M had. And to have a Hex Rally before a TCU game, it just, it just wouldn't feel right. And, other students are more willing to embrace a new team on the roster. Well, my sister is a senior here, so I've always been really excited to come here and experience it with her. And I've heard so much about the game and stuff for the past three years, so I was really excited. So it's kind of disappointing that A&M, we're not playing at A&M anymore, but I'm really excited to be the first class that gets to play TCU. I think it's really cool that I'm able to experience the last A&M Hex Rally and I'm also able to experience the first TCU Hex Rally, so I'm really excited. I think we'll miss the tradition of A&M, but starting a new one with TCU is going to be so much fun. The university is expecting a large turnout at the Hex Rally and the game on Thursday. Even with the loss of a rivalry, students and fans are still fired up to play TCU. Same Hex, same spirit, new game.